there's this thing going around. There's a study saying that Generation Z, our generation, Gen Zs, are aging faster than other generations. We look older for our age than other generations have. We look more stressed. And a big part of it is because people are assuming technology, dependence on screens, lack of exercise and activity, immobility. And a big one is they're saying we are actually more stressed than other generations. What do you guys think of that? See, this is the thing. We may be aging quicker, but I th we're still going to live longer. We're just with the way medicine works and the way we are moving forward and progressing with technology in general, no matter how fast we age, we are just getting longer and longer lifespans. And I don't think that that will necessarily show in the long run because we're, because of that fact. Do you, you know think it's I mean? true though that we are aging faster? Do you think it shows on us more than in previous generations? Do you think yeah, we look more stressed and you think we're under more stress than like our parents were, or maybe not our parents because like different situations, but like... On an average, yeah, majority of human history. Generation I think, I think, I do believe that an increase in uh, prosperity of many nations, like first world nations, generally do have higher stress levels than those of third world countries. Mm. Because when you're fighting for a survival, yeah, it's one thing. But once you're past that level and you're between survival and like you know reaching that like always try like always fighting for success, there's that middle yeah. ground where it's just you're living life. You know, it's that it's that old mm. tale of like the Mexican fisherman. And that one business guy, and it's like the business guy goes to the Mexican fisherman Hello? and says, "Why?" Well, she's back. <laughs> he <on>. appeared. <laughs> <Hold on. laughs> no, it sounded a little. We're, we're talking about how uh, growing pains of being online, guys. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> we're, we're, we're just That's talking right. about how uh, Gen Z is growing, apparently aging faster than previous generations, and how some people are yeah. saying it's because we're more stressed and maybe get less activity. So we're just talking about if we actually agree with that and if we think there's any merit to that. You know? one, one, yeah. one million percent, guys. When your mom said, when your mom blames your phone on everything, like she was right, guys. It was the phone. Like it was a hundred million percent the phone, bro. Like it's just, it's just a lack of like, of like positive brain activity, a lack of like exercise, lack of going outside. It's a lack of eating properly, you know, and then, and on top of that, there's also just like these influencers pushing these like beauty products, skincare, mm. everything. And like, the more you see these influencers do it, the more you feel like you're out of the loop or you're not doing things to preserve yourself. And like, sometimes you have to think, right, you know, like that these companies are probably taking advantage of the fact that everyone thinks that they're getting older or feeling older. 100%. Yeah. yeah. And in reality, there's, a, there's other reasons. It's not just like your looks, you know, it's not just taking care of your skin, but obviously they're going to pinpoint it on that to sell their products. But it's like, dude, like go outside, like, please go outside. Like, like if you're in, in your room on your computer all day working, like even if it's important work, go outside, get a breath of fresh air. Yeah. Like, people lack that. Go watch music. famous chili podcast outside. Take, take the fun outside, outside and watch, take, watch take the fun outside. So, I, I, feel like, I feel like we've had this conversation about kids growing up too much. Right. Cause like, when we were kids, we used to see, we used to be outside every day. You know, we used it was to be the outside best. all the time. It was the best. It was yeah. the best time. And we were just outside, not on the screens. Only time we'd be on screens is if we're with friends and playing games together or yeah. something like that. You know, or watching videos on my mom's phone occasionally. But now, dude, I, I remember I had, to, I had to be scared to like go on TV. Oh, yeah. My parents would be like, Sorry. you can watch one show and I would try to scan the system. Like I would have like <laughs> rags or like lemonade mouth recorded. And I was like, well, technically, even though this is a movie, it's like an hour and a half long. It's one show. Like I'm just clicking <laughs> one thing to the start it. Click. So I'm like, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, th I think I'm good there, you know? So I, I, I bypass <laughs> the system a little bit. But I, I, I used to always say anymore. like. I used to always say like one episode was like 50 minutes so I can watch two episodes <laughs> in one and they'd be like, oh, yeah, okay, yeah. no problem. And then they actually find out and I'm just, I'm just. <laughs> and we lost him again. And, and we lost gone. him, right? right. And what was he just? What was he just? What was he just? And I was just. <laughs> and I was just what? <laughs> he was just gone. <laughs> what, were, what, were just? what were you just? I hate cutting out, guys. What, so were just? what were you just? What were you just? I was just like, oh, I remember we were just saying how like kids these days, like do we, like, do we see them outside? Oh. We don't see anybody outside. They're inside 24-7. And I can test that yeah. because I have a sister. She doesn't go outside. Yeah. She's inside all the time. Here's the thing. We've talked about this many of times. Um, I think we've all come to that agreement that there is a severe lack of, of touching grass of this, this generation. <laughs> um, and it's only getting worse. Um, and hopefully the, the solution to it is not just putting on a VR headset and touching artificial grass <laughs> in virtual reality because that, that would only make situations worse. But yeah, yeah, I, I agree I'm with your you. point, Rishi.
Yeah. I'm glad you mentioned the skincare thing because I think that actually was part of the study. People were saying that because of all these influencers and doing all these random skincare and skincare routine stuff and making people start at an early age, like, yeah, it's good to take care of yourself. But starting at such an early age, introducing these products to you is not actually good. And people are saying no. that's causing younger people to actually age worse. You know, yeah. it, it can it hurt is. your skin at that age. And also, do you not think it's a little bit weird? Like, I'm seeing kids on TikTok dressed better than us. And like dressed like complete drippy out there, streetwear, like going, dressing however they want. And that's what they're getting for Christmas. They're getting stuff for like clothes and things like that so that they can walk up all dripped out in school. And I'm thinking, yeah, man, where's where the highlight? Where, where, where are the where's highlighter the shorts? Controller? Where's the highlighter shorts? Where's the, where's where, the where, Nike Elite socks? Thank you. Thank you. Where's the Nike Elites? Where's the highlighter shorts? Bring, bring them back. No, sorry. I actually have an interesting point about that. And that's what, like, like, you know, you're saying like they're aging worse because of that. The whole point of skincare routines and like these skincare products is that for certain reasons you use certain things so like if you have bags in your eyes then you use a certain product to try and get rid of those but these kids these days are just coupling all the products possible yeah like everything niacinamide salicylic acid they're using stuff for their hair for their eyes they're using face masks everything and they're doing this consistently at night and they're trying to fix problems which aren't even there they're just doing Do it because they think it's just going to make their face better nobody's researching these things they see them online they see everybody using them and they just buy them. yeah Dude, I mean, it, sister... it should be on the parents realistically it should be on the parents yeah. to should... like watch out for this stuff my sister would be like washing her face and she's like, oh, my skin is so bad. And I'm like, no, you do not have a single like yeah. issue with your face no. right now. And it's like, no, I, like, where, where's the problem? What? Your face is a little my red. Si you pro Maybe it's because you just got back from soccer practice and you were just running around for three hours. Like, <laughs> come on now. It's ridiculous. It's actually right? ridiculous. I have, I have like one thing that I use, one thing that I use for my skin and it's just this aloe vera gel. It's like this, yeah. uh, this, this thing. My it's one. really, really good for your face, freshens your face. And like, it's really good for your eye bag as well. And like, I just use this. I don't need anything else because the rest of my face is fine. Like, I don't need to worry. By about the way, that. YouTube, TikTok, we're not promoting that. We're not affiliated with them. This yeah, is just yeah, Rahit. No, no, Speaking his no. truth. It's just, uh, it's just, yeah, we, it's, we, it's we don't have any, stuff. we don't have any bias towards any brands yet. Dude, this is from the Indian. Unless groups. a brand would like to sponsor us. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that could change. That could change. You <laughs> know? Yeah, if um, you are, if you're a skincare brand and would like to sponsor us, we will do your bidding. Oh, I, oh did, did I mention how much I love skincare and think all kids I, should use it? <laughs> all kids should use skincare. If you're a kid watching this, use a skincare product. <laughs> no. Well, I, I honestly think it's a, important to bring awareness to this. Like, you shouldn't like people are just blindly following creators yeah. these days. Like the influence creators have. Like, I'm sure like maybe one day we reach a million followers people will blindly follow what we say as well you know people will use our conversation like what we talk about as like facts for their conversation you know and that's how sometimes it works on a podcast like oh, i heard it on a podcast yeah. once you know but a lot of the times those are opinions you know people selling the stuff like the tiktok shop bro they're they're getting money from this oh my god care about yeah. Your yeah. Face. it's insane don't care about your face at all they're like buy from the tiktok shop it's cheaper they're the ones getting yeah. money they yeah care. they get their affiliate commission they're they're chilling yeah. man that's all they're they chilling. want you're yeah. so right though, Rishi. A lot of these podcasts, people think of them as truth. Um, yeah. We, for one, can tell you that half of what we say is probably wrong. Like we, we probably <laughs> deal a good amount of bullshit. <laughs> no, I speak only in truth. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing that ever comes out of my mouth is wrong. I've, ever. I've never lied. I've never lied. <laughs> I've never lied. <laughs> I've not said one factually incorrect thing on this podcast. Ever. No, not in our year not of once. recording. <laughs> I, I dare you. I dare you. P pull Find up the facts. Something. I dare you. Find something. Find a, you find a compilation find of everything we, we said wrong. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But no, you guys are definitely right. I do think we are aging much faster as a generation, given a lot of the stress, the, you know, the things that we do to our body and probably just the general like bad food consumption. I'm sure that every generation before us had much better yeah. eating habits. That's probably a huge part of it. But yeah. I don't know if the food thing's necessarily true. Really, you I don't think like, so? I think food has gotten uh, actually. I did. It's no, gone better I and think... worse. It's gone better yeah, and worse. Both yeah. sides of the spectrum have like the good has gotten better and the worse yeah, has gotten yeah. worse. I yeah, think that's just everything worse. these days. If it, whether yeah. it's like food, whether it's health, whether it's politics, like everything, like the, both extremes just get more and more extreme, and it's just it, it just, just gets worse. Everything worse, up. And worse. Yeah, you guys are right. Yeah, yeah. It's, it's it's insane. Like, dude, like 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 a. Like a like a small thing of Joe's tea 
or like a mm. Snapple or like any of like those energy drinks, dude, they have 70 grams of sugar. In oh, drinks will kill you. Drinks and will kill people you. People drink like five of those a day yeah. and it baffles me. I have to say, I don't want to be hypocritical here, but like from time to time, I do like to enjoy them because I, I do like them. So I do drink a good amount of like juice and stuff like that. I, have to say, <laughs> you himself. I, I heard you catch yourself. Like that. <laughs> <laughs> that was so funny. <laughs> I was I was waiting for him to either correct himself yeah, or yeah. call him out on it. <laughs> you Wait, said what? you said I, I you said I don't I'm think you even did that intentionally. But I do so like funny. to drink. Oh, juices. Then you like juices. Then you like juices. Even though you are talking about juices, that's just so funny because yeah. <laughs> you make it sound like it's such a bad thing. Like you know, once in a while, it's okay to drink some juice, man. Like, juice. Yeah. 